an ongoing investigation, two teens under arrest, and several others temporarily removed from the classrooms. Guam Department of Education trying to put a stop to violence on their campuses. The latest happening last Friday, a riot at Tizen High School. 18-year-olds Mike Sinlipwi and Saparo Timothy arrested on multiple counts of riot, assault, and disorderly conduct. GDOE Superintendent Dr. Kenneth Swanson. Frequently we have a hard time having young folks understand that once you turn 18, the rules of life change. The riot also involving 15 to 20 other students. Short-term suspensions for everybody that was involved. The two 18-year-olds were transported, booked, and released uh, in home custody. But the investigation part still goes on. So that we, because we want to understand the underlying circumstances, because these things just don't happen out of the clear blue all by themselves. Court documents state both Lipwe and Timothy resorted to violence in defense of their friend, who was accused by another student of stealing a vape. Despite being warned by school staff, the pair allegedly continued punching students involved in the brawl and bystanders. Swanson hopes to get to the root of the issue. It can be a range of things, family conflicts uh, that go back that, that don't really involve the school, but they get expressed at school. I don't know what the underlying circumstances in this case. He says parents and guardians were all contacted. For now, GDOE student support services are working to help students make better decisions to avoid conflict and violence.